YouTube, what is up, JR Flores, with another video. Uh, what I have for you guys today is a screencast recording off my Galaxy S2. I'm going to start pushing out more videos like this. It's more going to be more easy or more uh, easy to manage and easier for you guys as well to access my content. Uh, so I'm going to start talking about technology news uh, much more than I have previously. It's going to be talking about the wireless industry to the technology industry, very some what, what not from what I have to talk about. So today I'm going to be talking about the new cell phone plans. I don't know if you guys heard it, but it's called the Univision Mobile. Uh, it's a popular TV channel as well. Univision is targeted to the Hispanic division uh, throughout the United States, and they uh, show news uh, programs, so many things that Univision offers. And they plan to partner up with T-Mobile in order to launch an M and MVNO and to target uh, Hispanic aimed devices and services to the Hispanic community throughout the United States, but more in particular, I think it's California, Nevada, Arizona, and all in that area as well. But I'm just looking at their plans right here, and it plans to offer great uh, plans and prices, which is surprisingly great. The base minimum is $30. You get unlimited talk and text on T-Mobile's network, which is great. And $45, you start getting unlimited talk and text and as well 2.5 gigabytes of full 3G data before going down on 2G speeds. And if you pay a little bit more, the $55 a month, you get unlimited talk, text, and data as well, but at 2.5 gigabytes of HSP plus before throttling back to 2G speeds. Another thing that they will be offering is offering 100 minutes here, 100 minutes of uh, domestic, I would say, worldwide usage to Latin America. And by doing that, it gives you 100 minutes of calling per month to on landline or cell phone numbers, which is great because most carriers offer, I guess, unlimited minutes or a certain amount of minutes only to mobile numbers, not landline. So it's nice to know that to all these places coming soon, we'll be getting Colombia, the Dominican Republic, Peru, Venezuela, Costa Rica, and much more. And the devices lineup that do, they do have are pretty great. Surprisingly, I was actually surprised there would be the Galaxy S3, which is there. It's not the latest and greatest, but it's one of the latest technology uh, phones out there. And as you can see here, are the plans that I do have here. And right here, as you can see, I can see an Alcatel One Touch and a SIM cards that they'll be doing to bring your own device onto the network as well. And I Three, two, one, and I heard that the plans that they're going to be supporting are really great. They're going to be supporting the Alcatel One Touch and as well the Galaxy S3. Just let me pull that up here real quick. So you can see the Galaxy S3 is right there. I'm not going to know how much it's going for, but I'm guessing it's going to be a very affordable price range from 100, uh, I mean 199 to 299 around there as well. But another thing I have to note that there already has been other carriers that have been trying to target the Hispanic community, such as Jennifer Lopez, the famous, the famous woman that she is, has actually launched a partnership with Verizon back last year called Viva Mobile and target throughout the whole United States the contract base and prepaid base offering phones as well so it's not just a prepaid but that's another thing that I'll talk about in another video. Once again I'm JR Flores this is one of my first uh, videos They're using a screencast app I hope you guys enjoyed it see you guys in my next video goodbye